hey y'all it's your girl nikki wilson here back with another youtube video um i want to do something a little bit different today i want to do something where y'all can get to know me um as a person a bit better so this video is going to be a bit different to what i usually do before i actually start though i wanted to let you guys know that i really appreciate all the love that you all have been showing me thank you so much to all my subscribers i really really love and appreciate you guys um i think i want to show my appreciation to you all and in order to do that i'm going to start doing um subby shout out so from my next video i think i'll start doing shout outs to those that i may have noticed any comments yeah i'll give you all some shout outs from the next video on one so let's get straight into this video so my real name my first name is nikisha and my middle names are melissa and abigail so now you all know my real name yeah so i've been locked three years and three months I started my journey on the fourth was it fifteenth the fifteenth of december twenty fourteen I started my love journey as you all know, I am in love with my hair I love my journey I love my locks I love thick locks I'm enjoying every second of my journey and you all know I'm on a semi free form um journey so this month was seven months. That I have not retwisted my hair. I haven't retwisted since August 15, 2017. So I love watermelons. Love, 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 ugh. love watermelons. I love watermelons. Watermelons are my absolute. Watermelon is my absolute favorite fruit. I love watermelons. I can literally sit down and eat half of a large melon in one day. I am sure I could sit and eat half of a melon in one day. That's how much I love watermelon. My least favorite fruit would be um, pears. I hate pears. I hate pears. I hate pears. I don't like the texture of it. I don't like how it tastes. I hate pears. I don't like it. Yeah, I hate it. So I don't eat chicken, I don't eat beef, I definitely don't eat pork, I haven't eaten pork since I was 18, so I definitely don't eat pork. Um, the only type of meat I eat is seafood, right? So I don't eat anything else but seafood. Um, speaking of meats, I no longer eat rice, pasta, um, and excessive flour, right? So I do eat like crackers i eat crackers with my eggs and things like that but to say eating bread and i don't eat bread i don't miss it it does nothing for me so i don't eat bread i absolutely don't eat processed foods i don't drink juice i don't drink juice i only drink water speaking of water i drink one gallon of water per day to be exact, I drink 4.5 liters of water every single day. So I drink at least one gallon of water every single day. And I'm telling you, I have noticed a huge difference in my body, my digestion, my hair, right? And my skin. It has done wonders for me drinking um, water. So I advise that if you all aren't getting enough water um, daily, you work on that as soon as possible because as i always say water is life life yes water is life <laughs> right so you all need to get your water in i do have a day job i work mondays to fridays eight to four at that job i also have an online store where i sell um women items cosmetics um makeup cosmetics um undergarments and adult toys things like that i sell those kind of things in my um online store and my husband and i also own a an auto company yes so i am a very busy woman my days literally go from 
7 a.m. to 8 p.m., sometimes later, Sunday to Sunday. I am always busy. I'm always working. I always have something to do. But I don't mind, right? Because I have goals to achieve and this is how I will achieve my goals. I have never traveled outside of Trinidad and Tobago. I am from Trinidad and Tobago, by the way, I live in Trinidad. Um, I've never traveled outside of Trinidad and Tobago um, because I have been, I am afraid of planes. <laughs> I always felt that if I step on a plane, it's, it'll crash. <laughs> I know, it may be silly, but that is how I felt. That is the way I felt. So. As a, until this moment, I've never felt the need to go anywhere, but I'm now starting to feel the need to face those fears and step on a plane and head to somewhere other than Trinidad and Tobago. Um, I would like to vacation in America, London and Canada, all three before the year 2020. So that I give myself this year and next year to travel to those three countries and have a short vacation. Even if it's a week, I want to travel to those, th those three countries within this year and next year. And I'm going to make that happen. I am 34 years old. I was born August 15, 1983. Yeah. I have been married 10, 10, 10, 10, 10 years to my husband. Um, we have no kids as yet. We're thinking about that, so that is to come. I don't know, me personally, because of how busy I am, I don't really have time to devote myself to a child at this moment. I know to some of you it may sound bad, but it's my reality, and that's the truth. So at this moment, I don't think it's a good idea for me, but you know, anything could happen. So I love roller coaster rides. In Trinidad, we call them, um, we call, I think you all would call it carnivals out there in, in um, America and stuff, but here we call it Coney Island. I love Coney Island. I love rides. I love going on the roller. I sh I go to see, I'm going to see roller coaster, but We've never really had an actual roller coaster. There was this little train like thing once. Yeah, it's pretty lame. So the roller coaster rides here, let's count that out. But I like roller coasters. You know, I actually go on all the most dangerous rides. The rides everybody would say, Emma says, why are you going on that? Yeah, I would go on that. That's me. That's me right there. Right? Um, I also love um water slides, the higher and the wavier the better yeah so i like those kind of things one of these days when i'm going um to one of those places i'll do a vlog for you guys so you can get to experience it with me all right one of the first places i want to go when i touch down in america is six flags comment below and tell me what you all think about six flags i really want to go to six flags i've always dreamt of going to six flags you all let me know what you think or comment and let me know where else you all think i could go um like that but i really feel like i want to go six flags i have to go six flags so as soon as i touch america maybe i'll take a little sleep and then head across to six flags find my way to six flags and ride all of the rides yes so i do love nature a lot i like being in places in my downtime i like being in places where there are lots of trees and and where i can hear water flowing um places like that really makes me feel relaxed and um peaceful and at ease you know so i like to go places like that when i'm in my downtime so I like hiking I like hiking and those kind of things right so that's things I like to do for leisure so guys I am from Trinidad and Tobago so of course I love my culture and I love my music which is soca and calypso that is my absolute favorite music right um, I also like dancehall reggae R&B 
and hip hop now I don't like all the hip hop and rap artists but I love Lil Wayne so I listen to some of his music okay let me be honest I listen to all of Lil Wayne music I love Lil Wayne I actually really do I've always loved him since he was very young till now I've followed him for a very long time so that's my favorite um hip-hop artist Lil Wayne my favorite reality show is definitely keeping up with the Kardashians I love that show I follow that show from the first episode straight through till now that is my absolute favorite show and I would follow that by um let me see love and hip-hop Atlanta the Atlanta franchise and Real Housewives of Atlanta yeah Real Housewives of Atlanta so those would be my top three favorite reality shows I love Empire I love watching Empire it makes me feel a type of way inside so I love watching Empire and if I had to follow that I would follow that with Scandal I really like Scandal as well yeah you all tell me what what are your favorite um series and reality shows comment below and let me know if i had to choose somewhere to live outside of trinidad and tobago i think i would choose atlanta based on what i have seen i really like atlanta i like um the people i like the homes i like everything about atlanta so if i had to choose somewhere outside of trinidad and tobago i would definitely choose Atlanta so Atlanta your girl is coming yes okay when it comes to jewelry I hate silver I don't like silver I don't like how silver looks on me as you can see I love gold love gold and when I say I love gold I don't mean I love gold I mean lots of gold I like to wear a lot of gold right so you could see i'm off of work so this is what i wear to work my band my rings and my earring right so this is how i like my jewelry i'm gonna wear i have one two three four holes four piercings in my ear on either side all my earrings chains bands anklets rings on each finger i don't know i really love gold i don't know if it's a bad thing or if it's a good thing i don't know but i love gold love 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 gold lots of gold yeah i eat veggies and fish for lunch every single day sunday to sunday and for breakfast i eat oats for dinner I eat eggs um, boiled eggs for dinner so that's what I eat every day yeah every day okay so my favorite go-to snack would definitely be um, nuts I like any type of nuts <laughs> sorry I like any type of nuts um, favorite would be cashew followed by peanuts pecans walnuts almonds yeah and then I also um, I'm also hooked on granola bars listen sis have an addiction I'm telling you I have an addiction I will sit and eat three packs of granola bars you see that native valley honey and oats I don't know I am addicted to it I will sit and eat three packs of that now each pack has two bars sis is gonna sit down and eat three packs which is six bars all at once I had to check myself and stop that immediately that couldn't have been healthy so I now brought it down to one pack per day which is two bars um, for the day right I have no food allergies up to this moment 
I've never eaten anything that gave me an allergic reaction so I have no food allergies that I know of my favorite subject in school um, I would say was social studies I really like social studies yeah I would follow that with um, principles of business those two were actually my two favorite subjects in school my least favorite subject though would have been principles of accounts I hate accounts hate 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 accounts I don't like accounts I obviously had to um, study accounts after school because I wanted to get into business so I had to study accounts but listen I hate accounts I hate being hot I don't know how people say they hate being cold maybe it is because they live in a country where it gets extremely cold and I live in the Caribbean where it's always extremely hot that may be it but I personally hate feeling hot I don't like feeling hot the AC is on in my house 24 7 literally I don't like feeling hot so this may be a little TMI but I don't sleep with any clothes my AC must be on a fan must be on me and um, I must have two covers and two pillows yeah that's the only so I'm gonna be comfortable at night anything else I am NOT going to be comfortable I will not sleep comfortably so I love learning about um, black history African history Caribbean history I feel that I cannot know who I am unless I know my ancestors where I come from right so I really enjoy learning more about black history more about African history you know more about the Caribbean history you know that is something I'm really interested in it's something I've been doing for a few years now I am five feet two inches tall and I weigh 130 pounds so this is short yes I am short I'm I'm sure you all probably would have noticed that from my videos but yes I am very short so all right guys thank you so much for watching my video I really wanted to do something different tonight something that um, you all would be able to get to know the human side of me yeah the human side of me um, you all will get to know me a little bit better you all can comment below and ask me anything else let me know what else you all would like to know about me remember you all are my family I told you all that you um, I made my little announcement showing you all some love on my Twitter if you are not um, following me on Twitter go ahead let's be friends on Twitter Instagram and snapchat come on let's keep this family going let's get a bigger community right you all are my extended family I love you all to death right um i appreciate the love that you all are showing me i appreciate those of you who, are, who would have subscribed to my channel and who are watching my videos and things like that you know i really appreciate you guys so don't forget to thumbs up this video don't forget to of course comment share punch the subscribe button and the notification bell right next to that subscribe button so thanks so much for watching guys subscribe subscribe now thank you bye guys peace and love